The votes in Liberia's general election may have been counted, but the wait goes on for those wanting to know the winner. With President Surley failing to secure 50% of the vote, a runoff against second-placed Winston Tubman's CDC party is now on the cards. The November the 8th rerun will see both courting support from Liberia's smaller parties, especially the surprised third-placed National Union for Democratic Progress of former warlord Prince Johnson. It secured almost 12% of the vote. When, you come, when it comes down to it, really, you looking at the negotiation skills of both parties. Who are those that are going to advance to sit to that negotiating table to give him what he wants? Because don't forget, he's a key player. He's a key player. He holds the balls right now to say whether United Party gets in the chair or whether CDC will be able to unseat United Party. For now, though, Johnson is playing his cards close to his chest. No, I don't want to jump the gun. You know, that's my trump card. I hold my trump card. <laughs> Accusations of fraud by opposition parties had threatened to disrupt final counting, spreading fear of a return to violence in a country still trying to shake off the legacy of 14 years of civil war. But with two clear front runners and a green light from international observers, the way is now clear for a second round poll. Any serious complaint at that stage and Liberia could yet see its fragile democracy and economic recovery falter once again.